Hi, I'm Ingrid. I teach at the Huntington Y, and I want to take you through a Bar Fusion Arms series um, class today. And you don't need any weights. We're just going to be using your own upper body strength. So first thing I want you to focus on is your posture. Plant your heels down into the ground. Elongate your spine all the way up through the top of your head like you're trying to reach up to the ceiling. Roll your shoulders down your back. Tuck your pelvis under and engage your abdominals, front of your thighs, and your glutes. And this is going to be your base position for this entire workout. Let's get started. Begin by rounding your arms in front of you, holding light tension in your shoulders. We're going to start here and lift up to your forehead. Back down and up. Remember, plant your heels and elongate your head as you lift and lower. Keep your abs tight and your shoulders rolling down your back. One and two. We're just living here for right now. Might feel like nothing right now, but you'll feel it shortly. Let's go for eight, seven, six, five, four more, three, two, hold it up here. Stay right above your forehead and extend out into a V. Flip those wrists away and reset. Good. Just hold it here. Try to keep your elbows right where they are. Again, pressing down into those heels, engaging your abs, your glutes, and the front of your thighs, and getting nice and tall through the upper body. Round and flip. Round and flip. You might start to feel it right about now. Turn those wrists away. Keep those elbows pretty much where they are. Now keep your shoulders down your back, relax your neck. Let's go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna bring your arms up to shoulder height. Pull them behind your, your back. Try to reach those elbows together and extend away. Flip those wrists, shoulder height. Squeeze and lift, squeeze and lift. Keep a tall upper body and plant those heels. Draw those arms together nice and tight, extend away. Ooh, you should be feeling this in your shoulders and the tops of your biceps. Nice and controlled, don't just fling your arms out. Control them up and down. Squeeze, extend, squeeze, extend. We've got eight and seven, six, five more, four, three, two, one, hold it up here and just flip those wrists. Hold them right at shoulder height. Turn and press away. It's really going to start to burn the new shoulders right about now. Push through it, give me a deep breath. Re-engage those abs, squeeze those glutes, and press down into those heels. Eight, and seven, and six, five, four, three, two, and one. We're going to bring your arms down here now. So half up, half down. Round your arms, lift, and reset. Bring those shoulders down your back. Engage your core. Lift and lower. Nice and easy. Squeeze your abdominals, lift and lower, and keep some tension right here in your pecs. Nice. Let's go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 more, 4, 3, 2, Hold it here and extend away. Round, extend. Round, extend. Round, extend. Keep that tension in your pecs as you round as if you're going to hug something. Push away. Push your palms down to the floor. It's going to burn. Breathe through it. Keep those abs tight. You get taller and longer for eight and seven, six, five, Four, three, feeling it, two, hold your arms up here, we're going to tilt down to the side, cross in front, reach away at a diagonal, cross and reach, cross and reach, try to keep your heels evenly planted, 
cross and reach. Nice. Let's get big. Really swoop in front and extend away. You're engaging your pecs here and you're slightly bent over at the waist here. Breathe through it. Let's go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6 more, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now you're coming back up to shoulder height. Swing, extend, wrap, extend. Try to think fluid motion here, almost as if you're underwater. Keep your arms up at shoulder height. Roll those shoulders down your back. Elongate your neck. Reset your form here. Breathe. Try to make it look easy, even though I know it's burning right now. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four more. Three. Two. And one. You guessed it. We're going this way now. Reach across. Extend. Really swoop, close, work your chest, and open up, extend away. If you want to gaze down to take a little tension out of your neck, that's absolutely fine here. But remember, you're at an angle here, tilted at the waist. Your feet are still planted evenly into the ground. Breathe. Let's go 10, 9, Seven, six, five, woo, four, three, two, and one. Let's bring it back up to your round and lift. This time we're going both directions. Center, down, center, up. Center, down, center, up. Remember, the more tired you get, the more likely you are to let those shoulders roll up and get tight in your neck. So keep those arms rolling down your back. Excuse me, keep those shoulders rolling down your back as you keep the tension in your arms. Press into your heels. How are we doing? I'm feeling this. Let's go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, and one. Right here, open up, elbows into your sides, coming out and lifting off to a V shape. So not out here, we're coming towards you in the front. Pull your elbows in, tap your core, lift away, palms to the ceiling. Think a tall upper body, lengthen that spine, squeeze and lift. Lift, up, and in. There you go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six more. Stomach's tight. Four, three, two. Pull them out. We're going to opposite swim, palms to the ceiling. Remember, your arms are in a V shape here. They're not directly forward, and they're not straight out to the side. Breathe. Try to roll those shoulders down your back. Keep your stomach engaged here. And let's flip those palms. Press away. Control this. Make sure you're not just flinging your arms out. You should be feeling this throughout the length of your arm, including your forearm. All right, let's go a couple more seconds here. All right, let's flip those wrists. Straight out now. Woo, you should be feeling this a little bit in the front of your arms as well. Keep those shoulders rolling down and back. Nice tall spine. And five, four, three, two, one. Take them out to the side. Here we go. We're going three circles, starting small. Think about the size of a grapefruit. Grapefruit, circling forward. First, this feels real easy. But it starts to get harder the longer you do this. Don't let your arms start to drift down. Keep them up at shoulder height. Nice, open, tall chest. Head reaching up to the ceiling. All right, we're going to go sort of like a basketball. 
beach ball, middle shape. So you just notch it up one size. You're still rolling forward, keeping those shoulders down behind you, long, tall neck. All right, ready to go full length. So this is almost like yoga ball size. Take it as big as you comfortably can. I'm afraid I'm gonna hit the wall behind me. So make sure you have enough space to do this. All right, we're gonna notch it back down, coming to that middle size. Keep those shoulders up, I know it's burning, you're doing great. And now let's go back to the small size. Four, three, two, one, palm to the ceiling. Let's roll back. Woo, you thought you were gonna rest. We're still at the small size here, but now you're rolling your arms in the opposite direction. Don't forget, stay tall, stay long here. Let's go middle size here. Try to keep an eye on it. Make sure your arms are drifting down towards the floor. All right, let's go big size. Remember, you're rolling behind you now. Keep your core engaged. So we've got a couple more here, and we're going to take it back to that middle side. In three, two, one, go middle. Keep that stomach engaged. Press down into those heels. All right, let's go small. Woo! Five, four, three, two, one. We're almost done. Bring those hands in and out. Like you're serving two platters off to the sides. Press down into the heels. Don't forget to breathe. Woo! Five through it. It's gonna burn. Three, two, one. Come in front of you. Close to the ceiling. Little presses up and down. You're really going to feel this on the side of your deltoids here, up in those shoulders. Breathe. Keep a long neck. Make sure you're not tensing in the neck. This looks like we're raising the roof. Press, press, press. Tight stomach. Getting tall. All right, we're going to walk it in. Bounce and walk it out. Breathe. You can do this at whatever pace you're comfortable with. Just take it in and out from the shoulder joint. Let's do a couple more. And right here, let's come in and out, tapping those elbows together. I call this elbow friends. Because your elbows never get a chance to hang out. So let's let them hang out. Pull them in. Squeeze along with that neck. Woo! Breathe through it. Really squeeze your pecs here. Engage your core. Press up through those heels. Let's go. Eight. And seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Hold it here. Flip those palms to your face. Reverse rock climbing. Woo! Breathe. Keep working. You're almost there. We're going to go full length now. Extend those arms up and away. Keep that core really strong. Get along through the spine. I know your arms feel like they might fall off. You're going to be okay. Now flip those palms around, full length. Kind of looks like you're climbing a wall or dancing. Reach, 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 reach. Good, let's take it down middle. Little scrubbers. You're almost there. Relax your neck. Hold it here, extend, and tap. Forward, thumbs back. You're keeping your arms up at shoulder height. Arms are parallel here. Let's go five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Roll those shoulders back. 
reach up, grab a hold of those fingers, get taller and longer, exhale, just swing those arms out now. Let's get the tension out of your shoulders here, and we're going to lean forward, let your arms hang, and sway side to side for a standing ragdoll. Slowly come on up. All right, let's take one arm forward, pull that palm away from you, and keep a little bit of a bend in your elbow. Now let's switch, just gently, to stretch out the front of your arms. Let's switch. And when you're ready, switch. Good, let's take those arms out, up, one elbow behind for a tricep stretch. I hope your arms felt that. Mine certainly did. Let's switch right here. All right, exhale. Bring those arms forward, basket, reach, round over. Take it up one more time. Exhale down. Thank you guys so much. Hope you enjoyed the arm bar fusion series.